ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Broadway. Well, I'm Diane. And I'm Heather. And I'm Julie. And together we're Broadway. Broadway. Wherever we go, whatever we do, we're gonna go through this together. We may not go far, but sure as a star, wherever we are, it's together. Really wonderful arrangements that are created specifically and originally for us. We were connected with an incredible orchestrator. No fits, no fights, no feuds, and no ego. She had connections with various uh, orchestras, and she said, you know, I think this would be a really great pop show. And we said, well, so do we. In a symphonic environment, because we're surrounded by these remarkable musicians, aided by these marvelous arrangements. What you don't know about women could fill a shelf of books. We will be able to give an audience the stories that are behind these songs. Composers like Cole Porter, Irving uh, Berlin, Irving Berlin, Gershwin, Gershwin, Sondheim, Thank you. Sondheim Jonathan Larson, Stephen Schwartz, Schwartz, yes. To now and then be reassured, your passion. We've gotten some wonderful orchestrators who take Diane's vision musically and are able to expand it even further and and give it another another level, another you know a whole other element and just create this beautiful sonic wave that people are going to hear on the stage. A couple of things we've done in particular. Uh, one is an arrangement of Somewhere Over the Rainbow with Somewhere from West Side Story. There's a time for us Someday a time for us Time together And the other one is my buddy, What'll I Do? What'll I do with just a photograph to tell my troubles to when I'm So much more than it was. I mean, that's what I'm looking forward to hearing. Everyone will enjoy the show. There truly is something for everyone in, in, in the Broadway show. There are comedic elements. Um, there's traditional musical theater elements. There's a little bit of classical thrown in there as well. Oh, yes. Right? We do a little bit of that. There's a Rossini piece. There's a little Rossini. Uh, that is the cat's meow, you might say. dealing with 40-odd new players with a different discipline and a, a different view of how they're going to play the music that you know and that you've taken very much uh, internally for a very long time. That changes things. And just to clear the air, I ask forgiveness for the things I've done you blame me for. But then I guess we know him. Another way that I, I look at it almost is if, if you've been making your, your favorite dish, that one dish that you really know how to make, and you're in your kitchen, and you've been cooking it your way, and it's good, it's a good dish. 
And then someone puts you in a professional kitchen with a crew of people who are going to help you with this dish. And you're gonna make the same dish, but suddenly they're saying, hey, let's add this and let's add that. And suddenly it becomes this bigger dish. It's still a good dish on its own, but something about that new kitchen. <laughs> Sorry, we're all hungry That's right now. <laughs> I was actually thinking it's like when you're knitting a scarf.